All right, hi guys, just a quick uh, video. This is the uh, Corad uh, power supply follow-up. Um, this is the new version with the fixed board. And here's the old board. Let's have a look at the processor board here. Here's the old board. And the new board looks, oh, uh, it's an identical layout, but they have changed the, uh, they have changed the current shunt a bit. It looks much better wound now. I like it. Plus, there's a bodge cap on there. Apparently the old one under uh, heavy load did on the display actually fluctuate a bit. So it looks like they've added just some uh, filtering on there or something like that. But they've actually um, also redesigned the uh, interface board as well. It's a different layout. You can see there's a common mode uh, choke on here where there wasn't a common mode choke before and they've done away with the um, ground lead now. They don't need to do that anymore. And also the transformer, there it is, 240 volts, 30 watts. And, uh, and the previous one was 220, of course. And uh, here is Big the, here's a surprise, folks. They um, said that they just changed the power transistors, but they haven't. It's a completely different layout. This is the, no, yeah, this is the previous one. And this is the new one. Check it out. Completely different. And uh, check out the little board they've got in there with the uh, power transistor leads coming through there. Totally different. They've added a thermistor down in there, which goes through a metal post down in there and, and, and measures the uh, temperature of the heatsink down in there. And there's a whole bunch of heatsink compound in there. And they've changed, and they have changed, the uh, power transistors as well but it's so it's a completely different layout and design they've completely redone it whereas they told us they only changed the power transistors so go figure there you go um and apparently as you've seen in uh, charles's video the new uh, power supply works uh fantastically so yeah it's a uh, winner but of course you know it's still rock bottom price um but you're absolutely getting a bargain at that sort of price because it's just you know the, the the performance per dollar is amazing but still it's good to see they've improved the design but why they didn't tell us i have no idea and we're going to have a whole bunch of these leftover boards what 16 of them 16 Charles? Yeah. 16 boards and um anyone who wants these uh assemblies all you got to do is pay postage and uh 50 lousy bucks and they're all yours <laughs> and, the, and the 50 bucks will and the 50 bucks will go to a charity children's charity children's charity for christmas there you go so if you want 16 of these if they're useful for you they've got a fan they've got a heat sink they've got um, power transistors which uh, blow if you put <laughs> too much if you overload them if you overload them too yeah. much but uh, there that's pretty useful I think that's a bargain so contact Charles actually it's more of a bargain folks you will actually get all three boards you'll get the this one the um, uh, processor board and an interface board as well ha oh, ha bargain